Child labor has been around since the beginning of slavery. Whether it is because of the family needs money to survive or because they are sold by their parents to strangers because they are unwanted, child labor exists. There are many ways in which a child can be sold into child slavery, and many ways other than being sold that they can be obtained. While many families need money to survive in Pakistan, some are encouraged to let their children go to work and learn more than they would in school. Some kids make soccer balls and shoes. They are often working in bad conditions and has to work all day long. Some works at good condition and go to school after half of a day working. But a child labor has one thing in common: that is earning a less amount of money every time they work. Pakistan has a per capita income of one thousand and nine hundred per year, meaning that a typical person survives barely on five dollars per day. And that's not all. Pakistan has a traditional culture where earning one of the person goes on feeding ten months, and with the high rate of inf- Inflation. It becomes difficult for a low-income population to survive. In Pakistan, child laborers are mostly at the age of five to fourteen years old. In the nineteen nineties, that one million children were working in the country, half of those under the age of ten. In nineteen ninety-six, the median age of a child entering the workforce was seven, down from eight years old was two years prior. In factories that are in good condition, will sometimes have sewing machines, which will be easier to make more of the shoes or soccer balls. But most of the factories are in bad conditions, and you have to sew by your own hand. So kids that work are very tired. Some of the big companies use child labor, such as Nike. Not only they make shoes, but Nike has been accused of ch- using child labor in the production of its soccer balls in Pakistan. About half of the world's soccer balls are made in Pakistan, and each one of them passes through a process of production where child labor is involved. Majority of child laborers have no access to any school or formal education system, as they have full-time work component. They mostly do not receive proper food and health care. Therefore, they have general poor health. So they get sick a lot and are in bad conditions. Child labor is a complex issue in every part of the world, including Pakistan. It is quite clear that everybody, especially parents and employers, are getting benefits of children involvement in labor. However, innocent children has always been the loser in this phenomenon. Child labor has existed for hundreds of years. Although it looks up there, it could be an insight. With the United Nations banning slavery in all countries involved in U- United Nations, the end may not be as close as we think. However, this is the way to slow it down.